I remember Warwick being kind of my furry awakening. You know, I'm not all the way a furry, but like a little bit. He looks fine. Okay, like, I don't want to thirst over a video of character because I feel like that's kind of, like, weird and, like, whatever. However, I would let him wrap his chains around my throat and fuck me senseless. His thrust, his tongue deep into my ass, licking all of my anal walls. He sucked and licked and slurped and tongue, going from my pussy to my ass and then back up again. He pressed deep down into my pussy. <laughs> Hello gorgeous divas, welcome back to my channel, I'm Luca Brugger and today we're going to be looking at the Winter Blessed skin previews that just came out. Full disclosure, I did try to film this video already, um, and then my mic was turned off, so cut to the footage of me talking for about 15 minutes with no reason. So yeah, we're gonna try again with my mic hopefully on. It was a blind reaction before, however, we'll go we'll go again. We'll try again, you know. Second time lucky, I guess. So the Winter Blessed skins last time was so so cute, I loved them. I remember Warwick being kind of my fairy awakening. You know, I'm not all the way a fairy, but like a little bit. I remember Diana's being absolutely stunning. Um, they were just all around really, really gorgeous. So I'm very excited for these ones to come back. I have some thoughts already that I already filmed, however, you couldn't hear them. So I guess we'll try again. Okay, so round two, I have the PBE preview over on Skin Spotlight's channel. Make sure you check them out, obviously, I'm sure you already know them. And we're gonna look at the PBE previews. I believe the splash arts have actually been released. When I filmed it before, it was just this video. So we'll check out the splash arts together as well and see what we're thinking. So we have Senna. Now Senna is the legendary, which... I don't know, I feel like she already got a legendary. I don't know if she needs another one, but that's okay. I think she looks very cool. The hair is stunning. The visual effects are lovely. The ultimate is wild, and I love the little transformation. I'm very into this one. Do I think she did a legendary? Probably not, but I'm not mad at her. And then this is Camille. We already kind of knew Camille was coming. She, like, Riot had confirmed she was getting a prestige for a while, and we kind of assumed it was the winter one. So I'm very glad to see her. I think she looks lovely. The little buns, they're kind of cute. A little ice skate time into that. Now Annie, Annie was a surprise for me. I wasn't expecting Annie at all. Um, but I think she's gorgeous. She's kind of giving me like young Elsa from Frozen. Um, which looks so so cute. And then Tibbers. Tibbers looks so cunt. Like look at that jacket. Fashion. Fashion. And the recalls are lovely. I don't know, I'm such a fan of this skin and I think all of them are lovely. Even the champions I don't like, I love them, the skins. Okay, so this is Huey. This is the new mid laner, if you've missed it. Um, he looks really, really fun. I'm probably going to have to do some YouTube videos playing him because I, I'm so into it. I think it looks so fun. And the skin is lovely. I mean, visual effects, the model, all of it is done. Now, I will say... Huey has a lot of abilities, so, you know, you're getting your value for money with skins. But I think it looks great. Lovely. It's so long, there's so many different abilities. He kind of gives me Jack Frost from that film where they had, like, Santa and the Tooth Fairy. I forget its name, it's giving that though. Lucian. I think he's cute. I don't think his model is my favourite, but I like the ability. But he looks fine. I'm not a massive Lucian player anyway, but he looks cute. And the recalls are cute too. Okay, Silas. It's hard for me to get excited about a Silas skin, because Silas is so... honestly homophobic. However, this skin is gorgeous. His chains kind of give, like... Anal bead, a little bit. They're kind of anal beady, but they're cute. This one I really like. He looks really cool. I love his model in this, in this skin. That's just really cool. 
so far, I'm liking all of these. Honestly, even the ones that like I'm not mad about, they're still really good. Three cool, so cool. Hecarim. Hecarim was a massive surprise to me. So I think the skin line got leaked like a few weeks ago. Hecarim wasn't mentioned at all, so I wasn't expecting him. But he looks fun. He's cute. I almost wish they went like a little a little bit more reined in on him. I think that could have been fun. But he's okay. That recall is gorgeous. And this is the Camille Prestige. I don't know if this is controversial. I feel like I kind of prefer the base one. I think the normal Winter Blast is cuter than Prestige, but that's okay. The little bob is kind of fun. Okay, so those are all the skin previews. The full videos, the full skin spotlights are on Skin Spotlight's YouTube channel. I won't go into them. If you want them, they'll be down below. They look really cool. I thought we'd go through the splash arts because I believe they have been released. Because I think the splash arts, they've been getting really good at them lately, at League. I don't know what they've been doing lately. They look really good. I mean, let's just not sit here and act like I ain't do shit to right. deserve to be called. I'm, I'm not saying that. Fuck my drag, right? Okay, this is Luke from the future. I'm editing. I just want to clarify, the splash arts are usually very cute. That sounded so cunty. However, lately they've just been extra, extra gorgeous. I don't know what they've been doing. I don't know if they've got new artists. I don't want to discredit anyone's work in the past. Obviously, they're all gorgeous. However, I do feel like lately they've been on a different level, like Luke key. Okay, so all the splash arts are on the League of Legends Twitter. This one is way cute. He looks cute. His base splash art, I don't know if you've seen it. It's really gorgeous. I think this one's really gorgeous too. I love these like, these effects that look so pretty. Okay, next we've got... Okay, that's Mother. Senna looks so cunt. Okay, that's a really good slash art. I love that one. Lucian. He looks okay. Well, you girls look good. He's cute. I think Lucian's like, is he the weakest one of the set? He looks fine. Okay, like, I don't want to thirst over a video character because I feel like that's kind of like weird and like whatever. However, I would let him wrap his chains around my throat and fuck me senseless, to be frank. Ew, Michelle. I think he looks so yummy. The glasses, the little cleavage, his little chest is out. Oh, I'm feeling this one. Why is Silas hot? Okay, and we've got Annie. Annie looks cute too. Um, This one, it looks really like cartoony to me, this one. I don't know why, but I think she looks cute. Tibbers in the background, looks lovely, fun. Hecarim. Hecarim, actually, I had a very brief Hecarim era, like a year ago, two years ago, maybe. I don't want to talk about it. However, his splash arts are usually really good. This one's no exception. This one looks lovely. All of these are really good. Thrash, also really good. Honestly, they've kind of nailed these skins. Camille. This is the base Winter Bless one, I believe. And she does look very, very cunt. I love the blades. Like, the ice details on the blades. That looks really fun. Are these... Are these braids? Or is it part of her skirt? I can't tell. I think it's part of her, her skirt. I don't think it's her hair. But she looks really cool. It would be kind of cunt if they were braids. That would be really fun. Wait. Okay, wait. That's really, really cunt. She looks very, very cool. To be honest, I think I prefer the base winter blessed skin. However, I always feel like getting the prestige is worth it just based on the splash shot. Like, that's mother. That is actually so cunt. Look at her little... Is it a bob? I feel like it's not a bob, but it's, it's cunt. The pose... I love all of that. That was really cool. Okay, now a little bonus that I completely forgot about. There's a new crystal ash skin. This is part of, I think it's the mythic skins they're called. They're the ones you can get with mythic essence. So with Talia had one, Leona had one. Ash has got this one. Okay. It's cute. I don't know if it's like groundbreaking. It's okay. It's not my favorite. I think honestly, these these crystal ones they've done, I've not really loved any of them that much. But I think she looks fine. And the splash shot, the splash shot is, I think, a lot better than the skin. She looks cool. But again, I'm not like obsessed. I think it's fine, but I don't think it's anything like revolutionary. But it looks okay. Honestly, I think the Winterblast skin's like massively outsold. 
I guess those are the skins, I guess. Um, I really like all of them, to be honest. I think Master Sundowns for me. Senna obviously is a legendary. Do I think she should have got it? Maybe not, but I think it is a really good skin. I think Silas looks really hot in his splash art, I'm sorry to say. I think they're all really good. I think Lucian maybe isn't as good as the rest, but I think they're fine. And the Ash skin, I don't know. I'm not sold on yet, but maybe it'll grow on me. The skins this year have honestly been really solid. I don't know, the teams have really stepped up. We had Fairy Core, we had uh, Soul Fighter. We've had some really good skins this year. What I would love to see if they bring back winter bless i would really have to see like frey or champions and tag on champions i think they'd fit in really well i mean immediately spring into mind i think a legendary winter bless lissandra skin would be so so kind i think a soraka skin would be really gorgeous in that skin line i think Tarek would be really cool Ash, honestly, Ash should have got a Winter Bless instead of a, a Crystal Skin. I think that would have been way cooler. Or them, like, Frelio Champions, I think they kind of, like, feel like a natural fit to me. And I think Lissandra's, like, so massively overdue a Legendary Skin. I think Winter Bless would be a really fun one for her. I think that fits very well for her. I would love to see it. I would like to see it. But let me know what you think down below of the skins. Do we like, do we not like? Who do you want to see in them? Who do you wish didn't get them? All that good stuff. Like, comment, subscribe, all that, I don't know, YouTuber shit. Love you all. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you all soon. Bye, everyone.